Hi everyone, this is Miracle Ogbo, a graduate assistant of the Research and Educational Service Department of Purdue New Libraries. In our last video, we talked about resources faculty suggest based on methodology. In today's video, we'll be talking about scores, audio, and visual resources. If you click on that, the first thing we find are online scores, IPA, and translation. The first three databases are databases that we can use to find score. The first is AR Music Anthology. Um, the next is Petrucci Music Anthology, which as we all know it is IMSLP. And the next is Classical Scores Library. If you click on AR Music Anthology, It takes you to their homepage. And if you fill in the composer, the title, and search, you will be able to find your scores. The next is IMSLP, which we all know or have used at some point. If you type in the name of music, let's say Guitar by Bizet. And we scroll down and click on the score. Now this takes you to the page where you can download the complete score. After clicking on the complete score, it takes about 15 seconds for this score to be completely downloaded into the computer or accessible for you to print it. Click to download. And voila, here is a score. Another really valuable resource is the IPA source. If you click on that, it takes you to the IPA source page. And let's take, for example, we're looking for the IPA for Nel Cor Punon Nisento. Click on the search tab. There it is. El Cor Pew Anonymy Center. This provides you with the word for word translation, the IPA, and also the general translation. I always advise that students take their time to learn how to write their IPA for themselves. Even though the source is a great resource and should be used, but not every piece of music can be found on IPA source. So I always advise that students take out time to learn how to write IPA and do their translations for themselves so that you don't get stranded when you don't find it on IPA source. Next, find audio and visual materials. Any of these databases will be very suitable for you to find audio and visual materials. One that's popularly used is the Naxos Music Library. If you click on Naxos Music Library, it takes you to this page and you can type the music you like. It works pretty similarly like YouTube. But Naxos has really good sound quality videos. Let's take, for example, we're looking for Pache Pache Mio Dio. I Click on search. Here it is. You will find audio and videos by famous singers. And they have really sound, good sound quality too. Feel free to explore any of these databases and find the music, the scores, the IPA and translations, or even videos and audios that you need for your classes or personally 